My name is Adrian Woodrup. I'm a digital solutions architect at ANS Group. I uh, design everything from uh, digital platforms, custom developed applications and software, uh, data platforms, and uh, do a lot with Dynamics and Power BI. Uh, in this video, I'm just going to run through uh, an app we've built uh, in, in two, maybe maybe three, four for the push days uh, to help with triaging COVID-19 uh, related incidents. So the, the, the idea behind this app is it's going to uh, they're going to have a call center. People at vulnerable or at risk are going to call in or be called, and they're going to be asked a, a number of questions to be work out if they're at, if they need help with things like shopping, food, or medicine. Um, it'll then take that that task, triage it to a hub manager. So a, a hub is 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 um, like an area uh, that manages a number of volunteers, and volunteers are assigned to a hub. Uh, the the air hub manager will then allocate that call to a volunteer. The volunteer will then pick up that task and um, complete it. So let's run through what the demo looks like. So this is what the, the call center screen uh, will be getting. They'll get this initial screen. Uh, they will ask the person calling in or they've called. Uh, is it Are you new? Have you called us before or have you called previously? So we'll, we'll do this. We've called before. Um, uh, confirm data protection. Um, enter all the details. Uh, I'll put some some phone numbers in here. Um, so that's basic details done. Now we're going into: uh, Do you need assistance? Is there someone in your family or friend that can help you, or, or do you need help? I'm going to put yes, I need help. No one I can talk to, and I feel a bit lonely. So this is more for uh, data referring to referring data at different date. Just just more data points, really. Next question is. Uh, uh, which of these issues relates to you? Have you been uh, contacted by NHS and do you need to self-isolate? Have you got, have you got um, uh, 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 any illness or underlying conditions? In this case, I'm going to put underlying condition and I need medical assistance. Uh, my local hub is going to be Ramsbottom. No, uh, special instructions. So this is more um, just, just how do we get in? Are, are you in a flat? Can we leave it under door or back door? That kind of thing. Um, I'm not going to type everything out. I'm just going to paste something that I've, I've, I've previously done so you don't have to watch that me type in. And that's it. Keep that reference number. We're done. Um, if I've called previously, so I can put any any form of search criteria in, it's going to just search the CDS, the Common Data Service. It's going to bring up a list of, uh, of Adrian's uh, and it's got my previous data so I can put more in there and change that round. I'm a hub manager now. I've got uh, I've logged into my application, so a hub manager could be actually a team of people or an individual person, more likely a team of people. So I'm AD authenticated. I've got the Power App. I've logged in, and I can do uh, one of uh, two things. I can either create uh, a new member, so a new volunteer, or I can manage jobs that have been allocated me from, to me from the call center or to my hub from the call center. So let's create a new member. Um, here I'd put in obviously the name, details, phone number, tech, uh, email address, uh, and, and do a, a, a address lookup. Um, and I won't be able to create that user without them proving their DBS checked. Um, so they put that in there. Anything where the email address is, they'd get a verification code where they'd have to go to the Power Portal uh, and just just put the verification code in and create that account there, and, and then give them access to the user portal, which I will show you in a second. Uh, so, okay, I've, I've done that now, so I'm coming back in and I'm managing jobs. So this is where the call center have allocated uh, jobs to my hub, and they've come in my queue, in my list. It's just a standard gallery list. Uh, do we need medicine or food? It could be both as well. It could be M and F, uh, and um, what it, uh, that is. So I've, I've I'm come in, it's got my address. It says what I need, um, uh, and a bit of information about what, what I'm after. I can click on uh, Google Maps, uh, and that will bring the, the, the map and show my location. Uh, I can then uh, look at the job and then allocate it to a team member. So, so I, I haven't actually built any team members in yet, so I, I can't search for anyone, but if I had, I could put that in there and allocate them the job. If there was an issue with the job, uh, I could put, that maybe it's not in the wrong postcode or it's, it's a different hub should be handling this, or there's a reason why I can't do it. I'd put, yes, there's an issue, uh, and then kick it back to, the, put some detail in there and escalate it, and I'd kick it back to the call center. So now we're going to look at uh, users portal. So, so this is where uh, it's Power Portal. I've logged in as a volunteer. Um, I'm uh, I've been allocated a job. So that previous screen of uh, allocating a job, I've been allocated a number of jobs. So again, I've got a list of my jobs, standard gallery. Uh, I'm, I'm going to go in. I'm, I'm looking at the task I've got to do. So I've got to take some uh, some um, uh, medicine to Adrian at this address. Again, I could look at the uh, the tab and, and bring open up Google Maps in the phone. Um, 
and look where I've got to go. So uh, I, I've gone, I've done it, I've passed Adrian's medicine, uh, it's all okay. Uh, did you complete it successfully? Yes, let's complete the job. Um, did, could it, if it couldn't, uh, for any reason, say I, I couldn't get access to them or they weren't in or there was an issue giving them the medicine or it was the wrong medicine, I'd put no, put some details why and escalate that back. That would go back to the hub um, manager's uh, uh, job list with the reason why I couldn't do that and, and let them escalate it there. I'm just going to complete this. Uh, and that's it. That, that That's pretty much the app. Uh, the next session I'll do is on uh, the data that's produced. I'll, I'll, I'll put a, a screenshot of the data produced from this from the Power BI.